by him. I nearly made that one, Barney. Let's see how I do with this one. I made it, Barney! This would be more fun if I had someone to play with. I wonder where everyone is. Hi, everyone! Hi, Jason. What are you doing up there? I'm playing a game. Come on up. Okay, here's the hat. Hi, Jason. Hi, Juan. I think I'll take a shortcut. Come on, follow the leader. Okay. Coming. Ring toss. Cool. I want to play. Okay. Come on, Juan. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Good. if we all take turns. Sure. Well, okay. You can go first, Juan. Yeah, thanks. I'll be second and I'll be third. <laughs> it looks like I'm last, but there's an extra ring. Whoa, in that case, I'll be last in line. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hi, everybody. Hi, Dad. Do you want to play ring toss with us, Barney? Thank you, Juan. I'd love to play. Ring toss is one of my favorite games. We're all taking turns, and Juan is going first. Well, that's great. Taking turns makes it more fun for everybody. <laughs> oh, we take turns. Oh, we take turns. In school each day. In school each day. That makes it fun. That makes it fun. For work or play. For work or play. Oh, we take turns in school each day. That's all right when you're playing alone, Juan. But when you're playing with friends, taking turns and sharing can be fun, too. Barney, what if we take turns deciding what we play today? Oh, okay. <laughs> that's a great way to learn about taking turns. Would you like to choose first, Juan? Thanks, Barney. <laughs> I know. This ring reminds me of when my family went to an ocean park. Why do rings remind you of that? There were some dolphins there that could jump to great big rings. <laughs> Why don't we pretend we're at an 
an ocean bar. Oh, holy, that's a whale of an idea, one. Oh, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I've never been to an ocean park. What was it like? It was really neat. There was a water show with a really big whale and a train that went all around the park. <laughs> what was your favorite thing? They had a big pretend ship. We got to play all over it. <laughs> hey, maybe we could build our own ship and play sea captain. Yeah, that's a good let's idea. look around and see what we can find. Okay. I'll bet there's something in the classroom we can use. Come on, one, let's go look. Okay. Oh, this is great. Oh, whoa. A hunting we will go, a hunting we will go. We're going on a treasure hunt, a hunting we will go. A hunting we will go, a hunting we will go. We're going on a treasure hunt, a hunting we will go. Oh, well, they see what we found. <laughs> Oh, boy. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Ahoy, mateys! You all did a super de duper job making a sailing ship. It looks like we're ready to head for the high seas. There's one last thing we need to do. Oh, what's that, Julie? We need to choose a captain for our ship. Oh. I think Barney should be the captain. Oh, Me no, too. I couldn't possibly help them, really. <laughs> In that case, I have something for you, Captain Barney. <laughs> It's a captain's whistle. Oh, oh, oh goody, a whistle. Oh, let's see if I can blow a tune. Huh? Wow. <laughs> You're really good, Barney. You didn't even use the whistle. That wasn't me whistling. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi, Hi, hey, guys, can we play too? Sure, come aboard. We're just about ready to set sail. <laughs> Me too. We could take turns. That's the idea, one. <laughs> Here, baby Bob. Why don't you go first? Oh, thank you. <laughs> if we're all ready, then trim the sheets. Ring the ship's bell. Ahoy, mateys! It's time to set sail. <laughs> sailing, sailing over the bounding main. For many a stormy wind shall blow till we come home again. Sailing, sailing over the bounding main. For many a stormy wind shall blow till we come home again. <laughs> okay, crew, whose turn is it at the wheel now? <laughs> oh, Jason's. <laughs> My blankie lies over the ocean. My blankie lies over the sea. My blankie lies over the ocean. Oh, bring back. Interesting on our trip, Barney? Well, if you use your imagination, you can see lots of interesting things. <laughs> Ahoy, BJ! Have you spotted any other ships or sea animals? Uh, not yet, Barney. Oh. Hey, wait a minute! Hmm? I think I see something. Oh. I see it too, BJ. What is it? I don't know. Hmm. Huh? Yeah. 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 That song you were singing reminds me of a story. Yarrata, everyone. That's how they say hello in Tahiti. Tahiti? Oh, it's a beautiful tropical island I've just visited, Juan. I heard a wonderful story about the sea there. It's called The Fisherman and His Wife. Would you like to hear it? Yeah! yeah. yeah. That'd be great. <laughs> oh, it's like a story. Once upon a time, there was a fisherman who'd fished all day and he hadn't caught anything. Suddenly, he felt a tug on the line. 
and he reeled up a shiny oh. fish. <laughs> this was no ordinary fish. No, no. Please, let me go, said the fish. I'm really an enchanted prince. <gasps> fish can't talk. You must be an enchanted prince. <laughs> so the fisherman let the fish go. The fisherman went home to the tiny old run-down shack where he lived with his wife. Didn't you catch anything? She scolded him. Only one fish, she said, but it was Enchanted Prince, so I let him go. <gasps> An Enchanted Prince? Why didn't you wish for something? She said. What would I wish for? We have all we need. Hmm, said the wife. This shack is tiny and old. Go back and ask the fish. Tell him that I want a nice house with a pretty garden all around. And since you let him go, he will be happy to grant my wish. Oh. So the fisherman went back to the sea and he called. Little fishy in the sea, please swim up and talk to me. My wife has pushed me out the door to come and ask for something more. The fish popped up. Why do you call me? He said. My wife wants a nice house with a pretty garden all around. Go home, said the fish. Your wife has her wish. And sure enough, the fisherman went home to a nice house with a pretty garden all around. But soon, the wife wanted even more. This house is too small, she said. Go back to the fish and tell him I want to live in a big castle with tall, tall towers. <gasps> this is a nice house. We have all we need, said the fisherman. But he went anyway, as his wife demanded. He went back to the sea and he called. Little fishy in the sea, sea. please swim up and talk to me. me. My, My wife, wife has pushed me out the door. door. What is it now, said the fish. My wife wants to live in a big castle with tall, tall towers. She shall have it, snorted the fish. The fisherman went home to a big castle with tall, tall towers and lots of servants to bring them everything they wanted. But still, the wife wasn't happy. Go back and tell the fish that I want all the land around the castle, as far as the eye can see. The fisherman was sad. Good wife, we have more than we need. Go, she shouted. And the fisherman went back to the sea and called. Little fishy in the sea, please swim up and talk to me. My wife has pushed me out the door to come and ask for something more. The fish was very angry. What do you want now, he said. My wife would like to have all the land around the castle as far as the eye can see. Well, let me tell you something, said the fish. I am a prince and not a fish. You've come to me for every wish. Now learn a lesson here indeed. Don't ask for more than what you need. And the fisherman went home. And what do you think he found? What? Oh, the beautiful big castle with the tall, tall towers and all of the servants were gone. Oh. And the fisherman's wife sat in the tiny, old, run-down shack that they had shared for many years. And that is where they live to this very day. The end. Wow. Thank you, everyone. Thank you very much. Thank you, Stella, for telling us such a super de duper story. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Well, well, I must be going. Nah, nah. Huh? That's how they say goodbye in Tahiti. Oh, I'll see. I'm off to tell more stories. <laughs> I'll see you soon. <laughs> Toodles. Bye-bye, Stella. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I like Stella's story about the fisherman and his wife. Well, it was oh, yeah. a good story, Jason. And it taught us not to fish. I mean, wish for more than we need. Hey, everybody. That story gave me an idea for what we could play next. Uh -huh. See if you can guess what I'm doing. Uh, um, I don't know. 
Throwing a baseball? Nope. Flying a kite? Uh-uh. Um, uh, I know, fishing. Oh, You're fishing. Uh, all right, <laughs> man, you guessed it. Oh, maybe we should all go fishing and see what we can catch. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh boy, let's go fishing, everybody! Yay! Pulls oh, ready? Here we go! Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let him go again. Why did you let him go? Because he bit my finger so. Which finger did he bite? This little finger on the right. <laughs> oh, Keep it, everybody. Lord. Anybody got a nibble yet? Where are the fishies? One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let him go again. Why did you let him go? Because he bit my finger so. Which finger did he bite? This little finger on the right. fishies down there? Hello, fishies. Barney, I have an idea for something special to do, but I think I'm going to need your help. Oh, I'd be happy to help you. What would you like to do? Oh, 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 oh what a super deep duper idea. This is going to be great fun. <laughs> oh, I wonder what Barney surprises. I don't know. <laughs> okay, is everybody ready? Yeah! Then let's go on an adventure! Oh, oh the adventure's <laughs> real! <laughs> this time, we're going to see what's under the ocean. There are all kinds of fish living under the sea. Oh, look, everybody! Look at all the pretty colors! Huh. <laughs> Those fish have tails that are yellow, just like my blankie! <laughs> <laughs> Animals that live in the ocean come in many different shapes and sizes. These sea animals are called rays. There are fish that are very big, like this one. And fish that are very long, like these. I know what that is, Barney. It's a starfish. Oh, right, Julie. And this tiny sea animal is called a seahorse. That's a funny-looking sea animal, Barney. <laughs> it's called a jellyfish. <laughs> Did you know that there are as many kinds of plants growing underwater as there are on land? Wow, it looks like a jungle down there. <laughs> <laughs> there are also many sea animals that live both on the land and underwater, like sea lions. <laughs> and these penguins. <laughs> Oh, look out! <laughs> and even big sea turtles like this one. It's an exciting world under the sea. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, what did you think about our ocean adventure? It was really neat. I didn't know there were so many different kinds of fish. Uh -huh. There were lots of different sizes of fish, too. Mm -hmm. Big ones, little ones, and everything in between. <laughs> Our aquarium only has little fish, Baby Bob. Oh, but they're pretty fish, and look at all the bubbles. <laughs> they only need a little bit of food each day. Oh. Ooh. Just a bitch. <laughs> you sure know a lot about fish. What else can you tell us about the aquarium? Well, you have to keep it clean and make sure you don't have too many fish uh -huh. or they won't have any room to swim around. Oh. Can you tell me how many fish there are? Sure. A 
really cool surprise. Uh -huh. Come on out and see it. <laughs> oh, goody, a surprise. Oh, come on, oh, okay. let's hurry. Oh, I wonder what the surprise could be. <laughs> surprise! Oh, bubbles, bubbles everywhere. <laughs> oh, my, I've never seen so many bubbles. <laughs> it was Julie's idea. She made all these bubbles for Baby Bob. For me? That's right, sissy. <laughs> Thank you, Julie. <laughs> You're welcome, Baby Bob. I got the idea from all the bubbles in the aquarium. Oh, <laughs> that's so nice, Julie. Baby Bob is lucky to have a friend like you. <laughs> Thank you for all the bubbles, Julie. <laughs> You're welcome. It was fun. Yeah. Come on, Sissy. It's time for us to go. Oh. Bye, everybody. I'll see bye you later. Bye. 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 Oh, surprising Baby Bop with all of those bubbles was a very nice thing to do, Julie. I like to do things for my friends that make them happy. Oh, just being with all my friends is what makes me happy. <laughs> I love you, you love me, we're a happy family with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Won't you say you love me too? <laughs> I love you, you love me. We're best friends like friends should be. With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. So long, Bye. everybody. Bye. 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 Take care. <laughs> and thanks for showing me that taking turns is fun, Bonnie. Oh, you're welcome, Juan. <laughs> so long Bye. now. Bye. Bye. <laughs> See you soon. <laughs> Hello again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never ends. Here's what we did today. I loved seeing everyone play together today. Ring toss is such a good game because we can take turns. We found lots of things to help us pretend we were all on a ship in the middle of the ocean. <laughs> BJ just loves to be the lookout, doesn't he? <laughs> you can be the lookout, too. Or the captain of the ship, blowing your whistle. Stella's visit was such a nice surprise. Her story about the fisherman and his wife taught us that we shouldn't ask for more than we need. And she's right, because there's always plenty for everyone when we share. Did you enjoy our visit to the deep blue sea? Oh, I sure did. <laughs> Some fish have pretty colors. Some have different shapes. This one looks like a star, doesn't it? It's a starfish. Wasn't it fun when we surprised Baby Bob with all those bubbles? <laughs> bubble, 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 bubble. <laughs> The best part of playing with friends is that we can share our toys and all the fun. And remember, I love you.